On the previous episode of Coastlines, we had our first day of kite fishing. We were trying to catch a wahoo from shore. Didn't get a wahoo, but we did manage to catch a huge lemon shark. Today, our goal is to catch as many different species of fish as possible. Day four here on San Salvador, and it is blowing. We had a lot of wind this morning, so we got a late start, and we also don't have a ton of fuel, and the gas stations are not open the weekends. Today's Sunday, so we have to be very mindful of that. I think our best bet is French Bay on the south side. It's protected from the wind. This whole side is done, we can't fish Yeah, the it. whole the whole east side of the island is blown out, so we have to fish French Bay, and then this side right here. And I think today we do that multi-species challenge. Like first two uh, 10 yeah, species that'd be wins. Fun. Yeah, I like that, that'd be a lot of fun. Oh, woo! -hoo. Look at that. We got it. Yeah, I think we just let's pre-cut it right here. Want to pre-cut it? Yeah, pre-cut it. Put the put it in the bag. That way you can just drop in and pick one out instead of I like that. Carting okay. a knife everywhere. I'll cut it. Dude, you know what I like about this knife, bro? Is this, dude? Like yeah, this, I do that, like that. That flexibility. Yeah. Is amazing. Yeah, that's good. Extreme. So I'm gonna fillet it, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna take the meat off, and then we're gonna use the skin part. Meat does not matter here. So we're gonna use this fish right here as the tip bait on our jigs. We're gonna use it because we, we kind of ran out of curly tails and there's not a tackle shop on the island. This is the closest we can get to French, I think it's French Bay, right? Yeah, French Bay is right here. So I think we start fishing right here and move our way down. I, I got a good feeling there might be some bonefish in there, bro. Might see your first ever bonefish. That'd be exciting. This wind is insane. Yeah, it's freaking blowing, dude. Makes you want to go offshore, doesn't it? <laughs> Absolutely not. These are the days where land-based fishing is the best. 10 species. Right there, shark, right there. Lemon shark. Here he comes. Oh gosh, he smells my jig. Here he comes, look at this. I'm not gonna get my jig, man. He's coming for my jig, like, this is hilarious. I don't know, hey, I did get whacked right here. You did? Yeah. You got bit off? No, I had a good fish on. There we go. Fish on. Mudding. What you got? Got a mudding, dude. I got dinner. Get him in. Little mudding, nice. Woo! He took me in the rocks and everything. First fish of the day, mudding snapper. There's definitely some fish here, guys. Got nine more species to go. We'll keep him for dinner. Let's go up to that rock point right there. Maybe we can wade out right there. Hey? Yeah. I don't know how far north we can go before we start getting into super snags. Um, I was looking at those trees over there. So we waded out to the rock flats. There, Preston caught a barracuda. After releasing the barracuda, we noticed there was rain headed our way. We got a storm over there, bro. It's headed right for us. Head back to the car. Okay, that sounds good to and me. Kind of check the radar and see what's going on, you yeah. know? <laughs> that storm is on us, dude. No. It's yeah. just different over here. All right, one of our dinners. It's gonna be tough today, dude. It's gonna be really tough. We got a lot of weather, a lot of wind. Not the best. I mean, obviously the west side of the island's gonna be the calmest, but we, 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 we've over, well, what we've learned already, uh, in terms of fish, the nor northeast point, which is completely wiped out right now, unless you fish the west side of it, or the uh, down here is going to be our best bet. Or by the hotel. Mm. It doesn't look too promising. It's got to be, I think it's a high tide spot. Hey, Josh. We're on an incline or we're running out of fuel? Yeah. We're, we're out, out of gas because you're on the incline, bro. They're right. <laughs> Hurry. Is that better? We almost ran out of gas. Yeah, we need to get off this. This is concerning. We're definitely low. The fuel uh, gauge may be completely wrong. We might be actually lower than we think we are. So, we are going to check one more spot and then we're going to head back and fish the marina because I think that's how much fuel we have left in the car. Should have fueled up on Friday, bro. Should have fueled up <laughs> oh, yeah, on Friday. 
We should have. That's all right. We got weather anyway, you know? Oh, we got mad weather all around us. There's like nothing we can do right now. Like this morning started off with rain and it's raining again. It's like we got to wait for this window to open up and we have to really try hard to catch fish. I mean, right now we got one mud and snapper and we're starving. We need, we need more fish to eat for dinner tonight. Yeah, we do, we do. But it is raining, we might just have to get wet, you know? You yeah. know, there's, up, there's ups and downs in life, or a lot of downs today, bro. Yeah. A lot of downs. We knew, we knew there was a big possibility, though. We're back here at Riding Rock. Eric's cooking our lunch right here. And there is actually a ton of fish back here on the rocks. He just hooked a giant raft. We see some trigger fish. Dude, I think we could uh, we could sway right here, bro. Yeah, I mean, rain. look at it. It's incredible. We could just walk right up to the window. Well, yeah, I, I agree. Let's try it. Perfect. About to be another wind knock. There we go. Good fish. Good fish. Oh, nice jack, dude. Why couldn't we catch him this easy when we were kite fishing yesterday? Should just fly the kites right off of here. Seriously. Fish on, fish on. Fish on. Get him, get him. Ah, come on, buddy. Big rat. Oh, big rat, bro. Keep that one. Keep that one, bro. Oh my gosh, giant rats, bro. I got one too. Strawberry grouper. <laughs> strawberry grouper. Dude, that 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 that, that rats is good. Oh, it's not a strawberry, bro. It's like a little NASA. Or I don't know what this is, dude. <gasps> Look at the parasite on him. Oh my gosh. Look at the parasite on the grouper. Oh my gosh. Woo, don't Same bite me. Family as the uh, hogfish. Yeah. The hogfish are not snappers. They're rats. So it should be called the hogfish rats. Another little grouper. Another grouper. Same one, different species. Same species. We both caught one of those. So what is that? I don't know. It's not a strawberry, I don't think. It might be. Fish behind the resort. What we got here? We got sautéed beans with minced uh, garlic and onion, sautéed to a nice translucent so it melts into the bean. Light salt spices. I'm boiling some water here with butter for our jasmine white rice. And over on the grill, we're gonna do some uh, steamed vegetables on the burner right over here. And then on the grill, once this is ready to go, we're gonna have grilled hot dogs and hamburgers. Uh, and it'll be ready to go. Nice lunch for everyone on the crew. It'll be re ready to rock this afternoon. How many, I'm at, I think I'm at five. How many pieces are you at? Uh, I don't know, five or six, something like that. I gotta catch one of those trigger fish, bro. I think, I think right here we could catch 10 species each, dude. There's Not so a little many bit fish smaller. in the water. I, I can get those triggers, hey? yeah. There we go. Same little piece of grouper. Oh, 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 there he goes. He gone. Put a piece of bait on. The weight, the, the weight of the bait is enough to cast it out. We don't have to go far, these fish are all closed. That's how we're gonna get all these trigger fish. They're not giant triggers, but they're triggers. There's a lot more species down there too. Hey, he's eating me, he's eating me. There we go, trigger fish on. Got yeah. him. Oh yeah, trigger baby, woo! Is that the, that's a different species, isn't it? Different that? species, yeah. Look at that trigger Definitely fish. Definitely a different species. He, he's chunky, bro. Yeah, look at that blue line on his on his dorsal fin. Which one? Oh my gosh, look at this, yeah, he's right. Look at that blue line right there, bro. It looks like a battery. Fluorescent. There we go, we got him. Oh, he's giant, dude. What is oh, it's it? It's so hard. Grass? Big pudding wipe, bro. Don't go on the rock, don't go on the rock, don't go on the rock, don't go on the rock. Oh, oh. <laughs> Number six for me. Oh, oh dude, the pretty. pudding wipe, bro. Look at that, guys. Pudding wipe wrasse, very, very good. Tastes very similar to hogfish. Delicious. I've eaten these before. They're unbelievably good, unbelievably good. Look at that mouth, just like a hogfish. Think you got me? There we go, trigger on. Sweet. Dinner, dinner. Yes, sir. Oh yeah, another trigger. Dude, they're so fat, bro. Look how fat, I mean, that's the fattest trigger. Listen, listen, no, he's making. Listen, listen, guys, listen. That's his fin making the noise. That's his fin right here. It's like a little airplane. <laughs> there we go, there we you go. got him, you got him? What'd you got? I don't know what I got. What do I oh, got? He's right there. It's a little Bro, snapper. It's a freaking, it's a schoolmaster. It's a schoolmaster. Woo! Nice snapper. We'll do him whole. Dude, oh yeah. That's number, is that number six or seven for me? Seven, I think. He's looking all over, telling you like this video and subscribe.
Oh my gosh, dude, you guys got blown up on. There we go, there we go. Big fish, big fish, big fish, big fish, big fish. Big fish. Definitely a big snapper. Taking a lot of line. We are maxed out. It's a real fish, guys, real fish. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna follow him. In the rocks. No! Oh, that was a real fish. What a shame. Wow. It's the first time I've really been defeated on this trip. That stings. Broke me off right in the rocks. Dude, I just lost a giant mudden, bro. Like a legit, like, 10 pounder. He broke me off in the rocks and I couldn't do anything. It's terrible. It's really bad. It's really bad, dude. That would have been good on the grill. Dude, that would have been good, bro. That sucks. Dude, I just lost like a 10 pound mudden, bro. No. Dead serious. Really? Bro, he cut me, he took me all the way around, he wrapped me around a rock, bro, and broke me off. Ah, oh, heartbreaker, man. Screaming drag, bro. No. <laughs> yes, dude. I did catch a pudding wife. Caught a pudding wife? Oh, dude. That's my first I, I, one. I'm so disoriented right now, bro. That's the first real fish I've lost this trip, dude. He's got smoke. There's nothing I could do. He was, yeah. he was running down the wall. Little live runner in there. I think this area is, is loaded. I was, there's a little blue trigger fish. Where? He was running out. I caught him. So, you did? Yeah. Is he in the bag? Yeah, but- uh, Blue? He was blue. He was all lit up. It like, looked like, like, a, like a file fish. But anyway, I was chasing him and that pudding wife they're extremely aggressive. They are. Like really aggressive. Yeah. Like it came up and got, so I caught the pudding wife and I lost the trigger at first. I couldn't find him. And then he was hanging out and I got him, so. Let's see, do you have him in the bag? Let's yeah. see what he looks like. He was super lit up in the water. See how like weird? Oh, dude. Yeah. This is the same one we caught earlier, bro. Yeah, see, it was just whiter. Yeah, look at this. Same one we caught earlier. It was just, just smaller. Yeah, he was really lit up in the water. Maybe wow. just different water here. That's sick, dude. We got some good eating fish in here, There's bro. There's a big pudding wife right there. Which one? Oh, wow. All right. I, do, I realistically don't think we're gonna hit 10 species today. That's a lot. That was huge ex expectations from shore. But we did catch a lot of variety. Let's go give it a few more minutes here. I think our lunch or slash early dinner is almost ready. Then we'll go eat. I think I caught like six or seven species. How many did you get? Six or seven, I yeah. think. I think uh, 10, 10 is really hard to do yeah. unless we really fish the whole yeah. island, dude. I think we caught the exact same species aside from the cuda, honestly. Yeah, but uh, we're gonna eat this beautiful meal here. Uh, I think we're finished, dude. I, I don't think we're ever gonna hit 10 species, dude. I don't think so. Not with the rain. The rain got in the way. The, the gas tank the got in the way. Gas tank, dude, the lights on. But dude, <laughs> how, how nice is Riding Rock? So so our gas tank ran out and Jason called his brother and they brought another car for us to use for tomorrow. Did they really? Yeah, man. I didn't know they that. Did that dude. These people are amazing here, guys. If you're gonna come to San Salvador, you gotta check out Riding Rock. The link's in the description. Go and check them out. And they're, it's on a Sunday. And dude, look at the fish we caught right behind here. Yeah. Dude, I wanna fly kites behind the resort, yeah, bro. We need like, to. It's, the edge is not really close, but I think if we fish in like 60 feet of water, just, just inside the edge. There's a lot of reef right there. I think we can get some nice mud in that, bro. Yeah, I do too. Oh my gosh, dude. He's fooling me, bro. He's fooling me, dude. Holy cow. Oh my gosh. 